Well, I've been doing a little research, and I found out you need to train falcons. Turns out falcons are hunting birds. Falcon, bring us back a vole. Sha-sha! <laughs> So Amicia about died. No, oh, yes. Yes? Yeah, you're- oh. oh. God, what was the last thing you remember, Lester? Amicia was being a bitch. We can't you're trust this man! You're gonna have to be more specific. <laughs> uh, I had a feeling. We can't trust fucking- Oh, oh, Vol- um, um, the- our- Ver, uh, Voldan. Yeah. We can't trust okay. Voldan. Did- so, did, uh, you- were you with us when that town was destroyed? Not exactly, but close enough. Like, like, the, like, we split through, and then it's just like, it's just getting worse. It's yeah, just getting worse. Yeah. There was there was a whole bunch of rats that, that just literally flooded the town. It was like a crashing tidal wave of rats <laughs> that just destroyed everything. We're talking about castles exploding and just showering rats out the side. <laughs> Little like, tsunami, like a demonic but... <laughs> arm bursting through the friggin' stone and just washing over the town. In rats. In, In rats. rats. And then And then Amicia is like, I bet somehow this is fucking Vodan's fault. <laughs> so so we, and we, then... we run back to our house. And then after we're back at our house, we, we see that, that Hugo's having a seizure, mom's trying to calm him down, and Valdon's like, young man, you would better stop having a seizure. <laughs> he's like, he's your son. Do something about him. <laughs> like, like, as if, like as if it's just like a crying baby. He's <laughs> like, ma'am, you should do something about your son this minute. And then, For the seizures that we're seeing the doctor for. Yeah, yeah. Imagine, imagine you check in to fucking medical doctor hospital man, and you're like, imagine how you go to the house. Wow, this is all peaking like fuck. Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> imagine you go to doctor house, you're like, house, house, please, I can't, I can't, I can't sit still, house. He's like, well, quit it. <laughs> that, no, no. That, but that does sound like house, yeah. though. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, unfortunately, that works. But then, a, 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 as the town is getting ravaged by rats, a fucking beam falls down, hits Vodan, and then the entire side of the house that he's on just falls away. So he's just fucking dead. Yeah. Like, he just disappears. He they disappears could, into happen. the sea of rats. Yeah. He so, couldn't depart efficiently, so he had to have some. Yeah, so so long story short, Amicia and Co. hire a boat, they go down a river, they... Yeah, because Vodan had yeah. prepared a, vote, a, a boat for them to leave town. In case of some dumb shit? Yeah, because yeah. basically they're like, oh, he's got like stage three rat <laughs> powers now. Yeah. He, there, there's no saving him, he's, he's gonna die. He's definitely going to die, and as he get as he is going to die, uh, or as he gets gr nearer to death, his powers are going to get out of control, and shit like this is going to happen everywhere. Only the Order can deal with it. We're going to take him to go see the Order, right? Okay. So he he has a boat ready. They're they're packing the child away. Amicia and Lancelot they go and they have the boat ready, and they're going down river on a boat, on the boat, right? For some reason. Even though we were at sea? I think? Yeah. No, we're trying we're getting we're trying to get to Marseille, that's why. And it's like Okay, but yeah. whatever. They're going down river on the boat, and then we are attacked by bandits that we start killing, and then the leader of the bandits gets upset fucking anchors the boat against the river and nearly kills Amicia. And that's that guy, Arno. Um, he nearly gets killed by rats? Yeah. Because Hugo starts freaking out and the rats start fucking raining like, like rat rain. And... So they all panic, they flee, they, they, they go their separate ways. Hugo is with Amicia, and Lucas and the mother are still on the boat when she lets the boat 
like she she removes the anchors that the the bandits put on the boat and she lets them drift away to god knows where they're they're gone they're, they're just, just gone. on their own <laughs> amicia and hugo start walking in a completely different uh, direction they meet some priests that get attacked by the knights from the town that they destroyed with the rat wave uh and then Arno saves them as they're being pursued by the knights because all of his men are dead and he's like, well, I got nothing better to do. Yeah, yeah basically. <laughs> and, he does, and, and he doesn't get brained because fuck it. He, the, Amicia like nearly leaves him alone surrounded by rats to die in a cave. But Hugo thinks that he's cool because Hugo likes, you know, he's like, oh, look at this guy. He's an awesome night man. And he listens to my stories and, and he, I don't know, gave me candy or something. And, <laughs> and, and to be fair, Arno has actually been treating them with a measure of like mercy and compassion too. Arno's an actually cool guy. Like he's yeah. actually been treating them decently. And Amicia, of course, has to, to shit all over his hospitality. <laughs> Touch me! I, I have my eye on you! You go, if he gets out of control, you unleash your rats on him! It's so fucking annoying yeah, for her. Yeah, and then, like, so, to, to fast forward, Arno takes them to see this pirate woman that he knows, and he's like, Sophia, you owe me! And she's like, but, but I have no crew, because well, I'm disbanding because the knights are after us, and we're surrounded by these rats. And he's like, "Yeah, but come on, you owe me." And she's like, "Okay, fine. I'll, I'll, I'll just do it. I'll you just son go." Of a bitch, I'm in. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, basically. So now we're we were on a boat. It was Arno, Sophia, Hugo, and Amicia, and they sailed to La what, Lacunia. What, the, what the uh, is apparently the island from Hugo's dream. Yep. And we just arrived. Yep. That only took six minutes. <laughs> yeah, I took all the time. Is it, is, wasn't the medical man like... Recap. What? Was the medical man like the smartest in relation to rat bite yes. or problem but disease? Allegedly. Yeah, but he's so, dead. So, like, again, imagine, like, you go to, like, the, the fucking brain surgeon. The expert. <laughs> you, you go and talk like, to... Hello, I'm going to regional. Well, yeah. <laughs> you talk to, uh... For you to see. Doctor Stay. Strange, yes. <laughs> like before the the fucking uh, the accident, the actual top brain surgeon, he's like, "Hey, quit it! Quit having brain cancer, idiot!" <laughs> so I heard of this dream and. All right, we already did all. Fuck. All right, well, whatever. Yeah, well, Lester wasn't here right. for it. Yeah. So it's uh, it's a bit strange, but well. I can't well, we even get a friend. Oh, yeah. Oh, kids are talking right now. I don't want to interrupt it. But... I don't care. They have a gun! <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, Amicia on the boat grabbed the crossbow that was mounted there. Yeah, there was a mounted crossbow on the boat. And it got unmounted when the bandits moored the ship to... Because they used grappling hooks to, to get it. And it fell off. She grabbed it. She's got a gun now. Could be she yeah. couldn't grab any oh, other crossbow. There, there, no, <laughs> it was just that specific one she needed. Also, she'll never use a sword. Yeah, swords are, <laughs> are <a tool laughs> swords are forbidden. Kill. But and and I guess the, the the main thing that happened is that once we disembarked, we got confronted by the fucking cult from Mid Samar, who were like, "Ah, yes, have you heard of the legend of the Child of Embers?" <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, no, is that why he has a flower? Crown? Yeah, that they gave him a flower crown, and they're talking about how like. You shouldn't tell them that it's a dream. And don't ask too many people. You never know. Yes. I'll ask. Yeah. <laughs> that, that's, that's the thing. Straight from our mother's garden. Hello, sir. Hello. What can I do for you? Need any spices? Maybe later. We've been told of a pond of water with healing properties. Do you know where it is? Not a clue. But there are many ways to be blessed during the brighter days. Huh. Good to know. Is there a big <laughs> he teleported behind me. 
few like he literally left. pulled the fucking Please Watson, do. dude. He was <laughs> well, he's here. You your time. You're welcome. Oh yeah. Gameplay wise, Arno is fucking awesome because literally he can one v one uh oh, yeah. enemy soldiers. <laughs> yeah, you know how you like you can command your allies to go do things? His thing is literally just killing people. <laughs> he just he runs up and he sword fights. So he is best girl. Yeah, <laughs> I I rather like him. I, I'm, I I joke about it, but I'm seriously comparing the relationship between everyone like a Joel Tess Ellie situation because he's the old grizzled guy. Sophia's the, the the drug runner who's been you know reluctantly dragged into this, but still owes them a favor. And and you know Amicia and Hugo are just you know they're they're the escort. Child. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm not from here, you know. I just come for the market. Maybe you have a bird. <laughs> well, thank you, sir. <laughs> Anytime. I got a bird I could give him. <laughs> what? Let's see the rest. Hey. <laughs> It, so, but yeah, that's uh, that's that that has been our crazy rat adventures for the past few for so few episodes. Just, it, it's it's the gameplay actually fucking really changed once this guy got introduced because all of a sudden it's like like send him into battle like you can send him into battle and then just like distract the other guards while he you know kills them one at a time. Uh, but hel okay. hello. what? Hello there. Would you sorry, I was talking. Oh yeah, sorry. Special bird. Like just so <laughs> everything's changed, but nothing's changed. Yeah. Not a yeah. Of, but mechanically speaking, it's great. <laughs> Story wise, four ways, it's the same <laughs> fucking hey. shit. Hey. Thank you, sir. May your day be bright. It's a little better, but it's still like. How are people? What? What? What's the worst possible decision? Nothing. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> well, he knows about seagulls. Be patient, I mean, Hugo. A, a little bit. I I feel like with with uh, Arno here, a, a, there's there's a much needed uh, not just decision making, but also a bit of th like there's balance now in the party. You don't just have like the the obnoxious girl and you know the kid too young to know better. In every possible situation, <laughs> there's now like a voice of reason to be like, "Hey, hey maybe, maybe you don't do that." Or, <laughs> "Oh, now come, come on, boy, don't, don't do the dumbest thing possible." Did she like get bonked in the head or something? Oh yeah, yeah. that was the thing. He fucking like pommeled her right in the face. Gave her a like actual literal concussion. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that lasted. You know, for a little bit and had no lasting consequences other than the scar. That's my favorite kind of plot development. <laughs> yeah. I... Let's... Uh, there, was, there was a bit, too, where she was having, like, terrible PTSD, right? And she kind of freaked out and killed, like, a whole army. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. I was telling Dean, like, I don't think that's coming back around. Like, we're not gonna see the end to that. Oh, <laughs> no, probably not. Because, yeah. I mean, I don't want it to be, like, hyper-involved. I don't want, like, a Kane and Lynch situation where it's like, oh, my God, every five seconds the screen just gets all fuzzy. You're shooting <laughs> at shit that doesn't exist. But at least give me, like, a little bit of the solid, the, you know, a big boss. Your eye got blasted out. So you kind of don't have a right eye, so you go to first person and it's awful. Oh shit! It's one of the knights. We need the way clear for the moment. They're just moving goods to the square. Can't wait to see the rest. I know. It gets better and better each year. The village stretches all the way up. We'll have to see it all then. Where are we going? I don't know. Like this way, I guess. Just pick a direction. It's it's tough because we're very What's slow. We're just walking. Goats. This man also teleports <laughs> a lot. <laughs> it, it's clear that they couldn't figure out how to fit like a grown man into 
you know, all the crawl spaces you go through. So he just kind of appears. On. Don't be afraid. No, this is a simulation game. Lucinda. There's goats. No, there's goats. Get oh my here. god. I can't believe you do this to me. That's I love you in goat. <laughs> you all right? She screamed at me. That's called bleating. It's how they talk. She's a goat, you know. That's what they do. But it's not nice. You were scared, that's all. Let's go. Thank you, sir. Anytime. Goodbye. Oh. I must say, no. This was just bonus? No, this is bonus. Actually be a good way to disorientate an enemy. <laughs> Can't wait to hear you bleat into battle. <laughs> Next time, maybe. Again. Dog. Goose. They're everywhere. <laughs> it's all of them. Damn, look at that goose. <laughs> Donkey! The most, <laughs> the most realistic goose in, in chicken physics since uh, Untitled Goose Game, I guess. <laughs> since Goose Simulator? You know goats don't have front teeth. Just like some of my men. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> Funny. Are we supposed to be talking to more people? Like, I, I think there's a, another path, yeah, on the opposite side, basically, like down there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I Oh, yeah, and I, I guess the besides Arno being, like, a game changer, like, we've also got the ability to shove people in the fires now. We can throw down tar that, that catches we've fire. Options. Yeah. We've got <laughs> things. Yeah, we, we, we've unlocked a, a variety of ways to, to murder. someone here. I, I, I just laughed because, like, after we were working so long for Arno, it fucking popped us another level of aggression. <laughs> yeah, I, I think it's going to be harder to get versions uh, or, or experience that isn't uh, aggression so long as we're, you know, Good doing afternoon. things that way. Hello. We've just arrived, and we heard about a beach with a pond not too far. Hmm. That's very specific. Anyone? Sorry, I really don't know. Me neither. There's also a big trail. Thank you anyway. Nice to see you, Amicia. What? What the fuck? <laughs> Bull did shit, let people talk. <laughs> did, did it interrupt? What the heck was that? I, I guess because we were Green standing still. So this week. Not of this world. We'll ask again. Ah, yes, yeah. let's ask this brave. Some feathers. Oh, oh. Wow. Yeah, a bird of prey, I'd say. A small one. Fast predator, smart as hell. That'll suit you. Here. Looking good, Shorty. Oh, smart as hell. You're definitely small. <laughs> what a predator you make. That that's his new thing now. Instead of flowers, he likes feathers. Oh, it's wonderful what they did with this place. Oh, do you remember when people were leaving for the continent? Yes. For a while I thought we'd be the last one standing in the village. But we will, my dear. We will. Thanks to your O to V. <laughs> True. How the fuck am I supposed to be going? Yeah, right? <laughs> Fudge. This was also bonus. I guess. We gotta... Okay, maybe unless... now that we've talked to all this, that guard has moved. Yeah. Sure, check it out. Hopefully. Uh, uh. <laughs> for a brief moment, I knew speed. <laughs> Speedrunners hate it. You're like the slow, ugly Sonic. You're so slow. Uh, that's my cringe. Yep, there we go. Come. Ha, can't wait to see that. They've got come. <laughs> Can we go too? Sure, sounds nice. Cyberpunk 2077. You can be tough. <laughs> different captain, different men, different land. Don't think so. Good. I hope there will be a dragon man. And I'd like to see a dragon man too. Targaryens? Rock dog. Just dragon. It's got good collagen. Uh. Uh. Uh, oh, hello? No? Okay. All this wasn't in my dream, but I love this place. It's all so 
dreamlike. Yes. No, I, I, I was I was gonna say I was think I think it's gonna make us go here to like talk to people, but may, maybe maybe this is the thing. Oh, we gotta try another oh, game. Oh, we gotta beat the next game. Yeah, <laughs> we, we we beat tower blocks last time. Well, hey, it's a midsummer, dude. Can we play? Sure. It's simple. I mean, they're all midsummer. It's over when you're out of pots. Never shoot twice at the same crown. Understand? Fine. All right. Let's see how I do. You'll win. <laughs> I'll judge you harshly if you don't. Please, I'm trying to focus. Ah, uh, the fuck? There you go. Right? Yes. I guess, yes. right? <laughs> I'm so proud of you. Oh no. Good start. <laughs> yes. Nice. Keep going. Slaughter them crowns. Bullseye. Impressive indeed. Astonishing work. May this be the sign of a blessing. Thank you. You're we did so it. Good. Those crowns didn't <laughs> have a chance. We got an achievement for that. <laughs> good job. <laughs> right. Can I have the rest of your pots? Yeah, I, I'd like those to, to at least recycle those, maybe. No? Okay. Guess oh, hey! A workbench, sure. Anything? Nope. Okay. Oh, yeah, we completed our. The, Crossbow you immediately tree. just got all of them. Yeah, because literally, it, it's it's well, what is it's like? Again? Look at these upgrades, right? So, uh, you can reload faster, you carry more bolts, and you can get bolts back after killing enemies with it. It's like, yeah, I want that. <laughs> Should be done if we haven't had a chance to use it yet. Like, literally, we just got that last upgrade. So, hopefully, when we get into a combat section, we'll be able to... We don't have enough to, pieces for anything but, else. Yeah. So, ho hopefully, we'll, once we get into a combat section... We also gain the ability to recycle, recycle knives and pots, too. Like, that's an important thing. So, like, it's been a case of, shit, just hold on to it. <laughs> like, we could use it to distract a guard... Or we could just get more pieces. True. <laughs> it's not a lot of pieces. It's usually like two piece per item. But it it do be pieces. Yes, and then add and adding up, so okay, you know. Good yeah. to have, good to cool. Chance! They're here. They must be about to start. Please stick to the rhythm, alright, Lucy? No improvisation. I sing for the child of embers and he needs energy. But not that much. All right, focus, please. We're going soon. Hurry up! Last year was so grand. You, you think they'll do better? I know they've been rehearsing for months. I hope they'll cross the main square once again. It's the best moment. We're gonna go ruin it. <laughs> rats are gonna show up. <laughs> We're gonna go be rats. We're gonna turn people into rats. We're rat men. Nope. Like Dr. Michael Morbius' Who's this child bat. of embers anyway? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just summon the bats. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, jeez. It really is midsummer. <laughs> Holy shit. Peaceful one. I so, <laughs> does that mean we get to sacrifice Hugo at the end of this? <laughs> oh, Let's God. Go. oh no, dude, we're gonna sacrifice Arno. Oh, He's no, the man no. what wronged Amicia. <laughs> we like Arno. We actually do like Arno. He's, he's finally, he's like, he's a good the guy. God's demand! <laughs> sacrifice! <laughs> God. No. No, I don't want it. Oh, look. Dances! Amicia dances! I see that. You know how to dance this, Arno? Do I look like it? Well, you never know. I'd like to see you dance. <laughs> You're 30 years too late, lad. I'll imagine it then. The walk of devotion has begun. The procession is coming. Let me see you quick. Blessed be the child of Edmund. Blessed be the mother. in time. Wow! Say, would you like to bless them with flowers? I just throw some at them. That's it? Like this? Blessed be the child! Wait, I'll bless the dancers too! If you go, blessed be everyone! <laughs> oh, Lord. It's done! Thank you! 
Sorry about that. Oh, don't be. He was true to his heart. Now they're blessed for many, many years. You're a savage, Shorty. Let's follow the parade! Sure. Let's go wreak havoc somewhere else. <laughs> hey, give us some flowers. <laughs> we gotta be blessing. <laughs> Close enough. All their throws go. suck. I can blame the kid for, you know, being small and a kid. But, sir. Sir, you're, not, sir, you're blessing you're that. Not even reaching that. Stop blessing that balcony. <laughs> that, bla that fucking that stairway, stairway has had enough, dude. <laughs> All you're doing is just making it hard for someone to get in their house tonight. I really wonder why. They're up there. Oh, God, the chop. Calm down. We'll catch up with them. Bum bum biddy biddy bum. <laughs> Blessed, is, Blessed the is the mother. The mother is about Blessed to speak. Is the A crowd. What's going on? We're gonna meet the mother. She's going to sacrifice a live goat on stage. Hell yeah. <laughs> and then she'll break out into Black Sabbath. It'll be pretty metal. Where is she? She should have been here already. Um, sorry, sire. Is that the man? Is oh, that's there's the, that's our count. That's you know he's bald, so he has to be evil. You all know me. Yes. I'm not a man of words. <laughs> Was what? that early? <laughs> she will be here soon. Is, is this what this Arno is after? He's gonna kill this guy? Words. Maybe. The words of a mother. The mother of the child of embers. The child who protects what? his sacred land it's him. from Come. the rats of disease and war. The rats? No, wait. Hey, what are you doing? Oh. It's because it's the Count Amicia. We had a deal. Call your rats. Wait, what? That was your deal? You uh. saved me so he would murder the Count for you? You survived. That comes with a price. No. You don't take advantage of a child and call it a deal, Arno. We can't okay, all this so that's what he wanted. You won't ruin that. Fuck it, I don't need you. No, you're a rhino. He's dumb. I knew it. <laughs> he said a fuck word. <laughs> I won't miss this time. I'll take care of him. Catch the girl. Oh, hey. <laughs> no, this is not our fight. Entertainment. <laughs> you gotta be shitting me. All right, I'm going in. Wow, nah. that was immediate. <laughs> that was just no, it allowed. <laughs> it fucks. Oh my god. Uh, you serious? They all have shields. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh. oh god. How do we... Oh, oh no. How do we skip? Oh. Is there like a... Oh, oh there, there we go. go. Okay, there we go. Um, I'll, I, I be holding. Okay, there we go. Always be holding. <laughs> really, Arno? Come on, man. <laughs> Look. He brokered a deal with the kid. <laughs> <laughs> he agreed to it. I, I can't. Uh, <laughs> did, 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 call, summoning those rats is gonna cause a lot of collateral damage. Like that's. Yeah, fuck them. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> in, in this case, I think she's a little bit more justified in being angry. It's a little fucked up. <laughs> Wait. So is this is or the, is this ain't the island? I seen it this I. It's got to be the island. This is why you can't trust people, Hugo. So the island is just also coincidentally where the count happened nice. to be. Yes. But it always turns bad. Always. Why? We're going back. It's too late. No. Things aren't always nice, but you can change them. How? The way we always do. We fight. We stop Arno before he does more damage. What? We save your team. Uh, uh, what? Uh, huh? Uh, what? Question All you can do is kill one dude. Like, yeah, like, what the fuck? I'm not saying it's good, but... He just wants to kill the one guy. Yeah, he ain't like he's saying murder the town. He's you know, I have to say, right? It's also the guy who... Like, is in charge of all the armies? Yeah, the, he's the guy that's been responsible for, like, trying to quarantine and lock down villages and shit. Like, like he's I'm also not saying he be thrilled. Not just quarantine and lockdown, but the, the murdering of? 
be good at this. He's obviously like a bad dude, you know? <laughs> like I I don't know. Maybe I I don't know what the fuck Arno's goddamn problem is, but uh also I mean, I'm going to assume it's a thing, you know, whatever the baggage he had, the person he failed to save, the yeah. the child he lost. He he lost, you know, Joel lost Sarah to the count. Right. <laughs> so now he wants to See, revenge. That, that's okay. Fair. Has to be something. A horse? A horse, of course? Uh, there's a workbench. A workbench that we still have not A normal workbench. No, oh, it wants us to have Hugo do something. This should be right behind it. Oh, hey. Right. Of course. I want that. Get it. Look, up there. We could climb and pass above the door. Oh, it's too high. Let's find something to climb up. Yes. This is the right thing. Oh, it is. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, well, we have, we have literally have such deep pockets. Holy oh, there it is. Okay. We gotta throw the child. I think that's a car behind. What? Well, why does he keep left bumpering us? I just, I don't, at this point, I don't know if it's just because that's the way the game is, or if, uh, oh, uh, I can throw him under here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna really, like, actually laugh if the game still figures out a way to, like, tell you to go ahead. Well, because here's the thing, right? Like, I don't know, with, with how quick it is, even though we had it on long, like, I don't know if it's just they always tell you what to do anyway, or... Like, if that's just baked into the dialogue? Yeah. Yeah. Like, and then, like, just part of the game. And then, like, the actual hint system is like, look here. Yeah. Because it doesn't make any goddamn sense if it's, like, always like that, you know? Is this not the. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, actually. Oh, wow. <laughs> We're full up again. There's Dang. nothing we could do. That's fine. We'll just get the next extended <laughs> thing <laughs> eventually. He said that it's because of the count that his shield is broken. Uh, and his shield represents, like, that's, a, that's his family crest, right? It's it's not just, th I, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it is, but also, that was that thing he said on the boat. Oh, right, right. The one time his shield for failed to save someone. Right. Or failed to protect someone. They, they, you killed my family. That's a classic one right there, sure. Yeah. Count killed his family. So again, why are we want to try to save the count? Uh, because it's because killing name? people is bad. I, I, I guess. <laughs> I, I, we can't just, kill just so fucking Amicia can be a hypocrite again. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. We can't kill people. Snap. <laughs> she says, and she yeah, yeah. Rambo stares into the fucking camera and goes, "Killing is bad." <laughs> I'm sorry. We're supposed to be like we're supposed to jump down. <laughs> why can't? Oh, well. Oh, that's why it wouldn't let me shoot him from there. You have a gun. You have two. No, it's too, it's too fast. It's too fast. Fuck you. <laughs> the Falcon reacts to the sight any noise. Stay behind cover as much as possible. Use your tools and the environment to distract him. Well, there's there's those. I see a rock over there. Yeah. That's the thing about. That's the thing about it. Oh, do I have to go while it's up? Yeah, while it's in mid-flight. Like, you throw a rock and then move. Ow. You can't possibly be this stupid. <laughs> right? So, do you think, like, 
lighting that Brazier will do anything? Try, to try it. See what happens. Maybe, maybe it'll serve as a distraction. But if it does, what? maybe we just hit the the, the, the stones again. Oh, oh go, go! <laughs> There's another one over here. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> okay. What? What? It didn't go for the thing. I know. <laughs> it went for the me. I know. I don't get it. Fuck, we're on this side. Okay. I was, because I was kind of hoping, I thought we were going to just drop down and then open that door from the other side and I was going to go to the workbench. But I guess now there's Falcon battle. <laughs> right. <laughs> you to come back to this? Yeah, we'll fucking come back to the fucking Falcon <laughs> Okay, we'll be back. Save the fucking Arno. Who are you? Amicia. And this is Hugo, my brother. He's a bit afraid. Well, don't be. There was more fright than danger. These days are dedicated to life and peace. 